Hi everyone, how are you? I hope you all are doing well and welcome back to GSTIC Park. In this video, we'll be discussing about the revision of section number 17 of ITC part 2. Again, part 2, we are discussing about ITC section number 17, apportionment of the credit and blocked credit. So the uh, you know, now you know how to take the ITC section number 16. We discussed that in section number 16 that what are the conditions where you can take the ITC and what are the rules which are uh, required for uh, required to be followed for taking the ITC. Now section number 17 where you can apportion the credit whatever the credit that you have taken how to apportion it and blocked credit. There are some credit which are blocked. Na baba na you cannot take ITC. Huh. Section number 16 subsection sorry section number 17 subsection 1. So here the goods or services which you have taken, you have purchased for business as well as non-business purpose. Then whatever the goods that you have taken no, or services that you have taken no, which are used for business purpose, you take the ITC. The not business purpose, you, can, you have to leave the ITC. You cannot take the ITC for the personal purpose. You don't get the ITC. So which says that where the goods or services or both are used for registered person uh, used by registered person partly for the purpose of the business and partly for other purpose the amount of credit shall be restricted to so much the, of the input as attributable to the purpose of his business later you have purchased section number 17 subsection 2 which says that goods or services which are used by the registered person partly for effecting taxable supplies partly for effecting zero rated supply no sorry partly for effecting taxable and zero rated supply and partly for effecting the uh, exempt supplies. So now the GST ka ITC will be restricted to so so much of the tax which is attributable to the said taxable supplies including zero rated supplies. Now one question will come sir what is zero rated supply? Zero rated supplies means tax rate is zero? No that is nil rated supply. So that means tax uh, zero rated supplies means there is no tax sir? No that is exempt supplies. So then what is zero rated supply? Zero rated supply means the supplying to the SEZ or export that is zero rated supply so you are using any goods for example you are you have purchased a machinery machinery you are using for taxable purpose you are producing some goods which is taxable supplies and you are producing some goods which is exempt supplies now the machinery may whatever the itc that you have taken you have to apportion between the taxable supplies and exempt supplies taxable and zero rated supplies and exempt supplies so the tax which is there itc which is attributable towards the taxable supplies no Taxable and zero rated supplies, you will get it. For others, you will not get it. Section number 17, subsection 2 is done. Section number 17, subsection 3 says that if for the purpose of section number 17, subsection 2, what is the exempt supplies? What is the meaning of exempt supplies? Exempt supply means as prescribed. That means exempt, exempt supplies includes zero rated, uh, exempt supply includes nil rated supply, wholly exempt supplies, non taxable supplies. That is as prescribed, sir. And there are extra three items now which says that. It is inward supplies under RCM. Inward supply under RCM that is included. Second one, the sale of securities. Sale of securities was also included. And next one, sixth point is, is sale of completed buildings. Sir, what is completed buildings? The buildings on which the entire consideration is received after completion certificate or first occupancy, whichever is earlier. So after that, anything that you receive, no, that means entire consideration you receive after that, that is completed building. And the next one is sale of land. That is also not, uh, that is also considered as exempt supplies. These are the seven items which are considered as exempt supplies that is given in section number 17, subsection 3. Okay, sir. Uske baad, we discussed about section number 17, subsection 4. Section number 17 subsection 4 is not there in your syllabus but let me explain you what is section number 17 subsection 4 for banking and NBFC or any other financial institution for them they have two options to take ITC they can go for section number 17 subsection 2 that means any goods or services that they are using for exempt supplies and uh, taxable and zero rated supplies then whatever the GST which is applicable to taxable and zero rated supply that they can take ITC and which is they are using it for exempt supplies no on that they cannot take itc that is told in section number 17 subsection 2 they can banking companies they can go for section number 17 subsection 2 or they will get one more option the option is they can uh, avail 50 percent of the itc and other 50 percent of the itc is lapsed so this is for nbfc banking and uh, banking companies basically banking companies section number 17 subsection 5 here we are with the blocked credits the 
credit which are blocked. So that we are going to discuss now, notwithstanding anything contained in subsection 1 of section number 16 and subsection 1 of section number 18, 18 May that we will study in next part, next revision part. So here section number 17 subsection 5 which is blocked credit which says that notwithstanding anything contained in section number 16 subsection 1 that means anything that you purchase that you use for business purpose intended to be used for business purpose or not you will not get uh, ITC, ITC is blocked input tax credit is blocked in that the first one is motor vehicle for transportation of persons so motor vehicle which is meant for transportation of persons and the carrying the capacity capacity the seating capacity is not more than 13 members including the driver then you will not get the itc provided see remember that motor vehicle uh, on for carrying the persons you are purchasing the motor vehicle for carrying the persons but seating capacity is less than or equal to less than or equal to 13 members including the driver then you will not get the itc see if the seating capacity is more than 13 members sir you will get itc you use it for any purpose for transportation of goods transportation of passengers you you take it for any purpose more than 13 members you will get itc less than or equal to 13 members you will not get itc even if you use it for transportation of goods sir i will not get itc except in three conditions if for the further supply if you use this for further supply that means example now uh, tata tata showroom they are purchasing tata car and for what purpose sir for selling purpose for further supply if they uh, purchase this then in that case for tata car they will get the itc second one for transportation of passengers sir i am purchasing the tata car car for what purpose not for my personal purpose my business is to transport the passengers transportation of passengers then i will get itc sir next one uh, imparting training on driving such a, such a motor vehicle that means driving class ke liye I am purchasing any car no then I, in that case I will not get ITC oh sorry I will get ITC I am so sorry I will get ITC huh. next one section number 17 subsection 5 clause AA which says that vessel or aircraft on that you will not get ITC not get ITC except if you are using that for further supply you will get ITC transportation of passengers you will get ITC Training, imparting training on navigation uh, of such vessel, you will get ITC. Imparting training on flying of such aircraft, you will get ITC. Transportation of goods, you will get ITC. Sir, next one, AB, section number 17, subsection 5, AB, which says that services or general insurance, maintenance or any repairs that you do on the vehicle, aircraft and vessel, which is mentioned above, you will not get ITC, except if it is used for the purpose which is mentioned in that. That means, if there you get ITC, here also you will get ITC. There you don't get ITC, here you will not get ITC. Provided, provided ITC on insurance repairs maintenance is applicable to those, such way, uh, will be available for one more, one more point is that service uh, where received by the taxable person, where it is received by a taxable person, that is manufacturer. If this manufacturer, then they will get and the second one is general insurance companies taking general insurance from another then on that general insurance they will get the ITC correct yes sir section number 17 subsection 5 clause B sir on the following supplies you will not get ITC you remember Hrithik Roshan not Hrithik Roshan Shahru Khan ka example Shahru Khan is doing beauty treatment in that case outdoor catering services food and beverage services on that he will not get ITC and later he will get some pimples or something they later he will go to the uh, he will take renting he will take renting of the vehicle vessel or aircraft which is mentioned in that uh, section number 17 subsection 5a and aa if he is renting that on that renting he will take it on rent no or for that if he pays gst on that he will not get idc where he will go sir for healthcare services surgery plastic surgery on that they will not get itc and that is healthcare service healthcare services sorry health services health services on that he will not get itc later sir health insurance insurance on that also we will not get life insurance health insurance pay we will not get itc all these points are given here sharuk khan ka example section number 17 subsection 5 clause b section number 17 subsection 5 clause b1 that is given and one more point sir you will get the itc on all the sharuk khan related services if you get the itc on all the sharuk khan related itcs provided gst Sharukan related services provided if you are taking that services for further supply of same category services then you will get ITC yes sir understood section number 17 subsection 5 clause B in that uh, sub clause 2 
विच से इज दैट मेंबरशिप इन क्लब हेल्थ एंड फिटनेस सेंटर यू विल नॉट गेट आई डी एक्सेप्ट एक्सेप्ट इफ इट इज द स्टैच्यूटरी प्रोविजन देन यू विल गेट आई डी सेक्शन नंबर सेवेंटीन सब सेक्शन फाइव क्लास बी third point which says that travel benefit which is extended to the employees on vacation you will not get idc except which is ha huh, provided the input tax credit in respect of such goods or service or both shall be available where it is obligatory for an employer to provide under any law then it is available that means i am the employer you are the employee i am extending you the travel benefits or i am giving you the club or health or fitness center ka uh, any membership in that case itc for me it is not available provided if i am getting that uh, if i i was obliged or uh, the law says that it is obligatory for me to give it then i can take itc section number 17 subsection 5 clause c better we will understand with the help of this here section number 17 subsection 5 clause 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 b here section number 17 subsection 5 clause b in that third one works contract or construction of immovable property so while doing the class no we have done a mistake so the mistake is that on works contract you will not get itc for what sir for construction of immovable property not being plant and machinery correct no you will get itc on sir then we will get itc on construction uh, works contract sir we will get itc on works contract yes we will get itc on works contract only in some cases correct no so that we discuss finally we can come to this point this is this is what i wanted to tell you on works contract i will not get itc remember on works contract i will not get itc if i am taking that works contract for construction of immovable property i will not get itc except except point number 1 if i am also the works contractor for my client purpose i am taking works contract then i will get itc i am i am not the worst contractor i am taking the worst contract for what purpose for plant and machinery i will get itc i will get itc second exception third one is that when i am taking the uh, services i am taking works contract services very important one i am taking works contract services and i am putting that in the pnl account then i will get itc remember so here it is given that for construction of eligible plant and machinery in this see itc is allowed whether or not you will ex, uh, whether expenses are capitalized or not plant and machinery may you capitalize or not you will get itc you will get itc and one more when the works contract service is availed by a works contractor for being used for providing works contract services i am a works contractor i am getting works contract for what purpose sir for my client purpose not for me for my client purpose then i will get itc one more is when the value of works contract service is not capitalized then you will not uh, not capitalize you are not capitalizing but works contract services you are putting it in the pnl account in this case itc is allowed to all the recipient irrespective of their line of business it is not possible that you are uh, uh, i mean if you take works contract for what purpose sir for some building or might be anything but you are not capitalizing that you are putting it in the pnl account then you will get itc this is about works contract sir next one section number 17 subsection 5 uh, class b sorry class c mein works contract mein i have one more doubt sir class d sorry class not uh, uh, c class d self construction i will not take works contract sir i will purchase the building materials i will purchase everything which is required uh, which is taken by the works contractor and i will hire one some service provider and i will start constructing it on my own will i get itc on all these goods and services sir no blocked so that is except except when i when i can take sir only in three situations for construction of eligible plant and machinery i am purchasing bricks sand or cement tmt bars all this for what purpose for construction of plant and machinery then i will get eligible plant and machinery sir what is eligible plant and machinery the plant and machinery except any plant fixtures or anything except except land and buildings except land and buildings next one telecommunication tower except telecommunication tower third one pipeline which is outside the factory premises remember pipeline inside the factory premises you will get idc pipelines outside the factory premises telecommunication tower and one more one more is that the land and buildings land and buildings telecommunication tower pipeline outside the premises land and buildings uh, telecommunication tower pipelines outside the outside the uh, premises then you will not get itc because it is not plant and machinery it is not eligible plant and machinery ha huh. 
when the value of the goods and or services is not capitalized if you are not capitalizing you are putting this in the pnl account you will get itc where the construction is not on own account i am doing that for my my client purpose sir nothing but worst contractor kind of worst contractor i am taking all these goods i will get itc in the account and record chapters may we have discussed that being a worst contractor i have to keep all the accounts of the registered person from where i am taking the goods which goods i am taking where i am keeping it and to what extent i am using it i can take itc for that purpose so this is about section number 17 subsection 5 clause d section number 17 subsection 5 clause a e. i am a composition dealer can i take itc on the goods which i am purchasing sir no 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 i cannot take it section number 10 may we have discussed that i cannot take itc i cannot give itc i cannot take itc i cannot give itc finished section number 17 subsection 5 clause f sir in case of non resident taxable person if he is uh, if he is purchasing in india if it's selling in india then he will get he will not get itc he will not get itc he will get itc only in case of he is importing from other country then he will get itc see itc on goods imported by non resident taxable person is allowed itc on services imported by him is blocked so it is specifically given only uh, goods pay goods pay itc is allowed but services pay itc is not allowed if you import the goods you will get the itc but if you import the service itc is not allowed next one sir inward supplies used for personal consumption gone you will not get itc why because section number 17 subsection 1 may it is given section number 16 subsection 1 may it is given and here it is given again consumption for personal purpose you will not get itc thank you sir i know sir section number 17 subsection 5 h sir goods are free samples if i am giving free samples no itc if i am giving gift no itc if i am if the goods is lost no itc if the goods is stolen no itc if the goods are uh, goods jaye bhad mein itc jaye bhad mein we are getting this okay again free samples means free free samples you gave free samples itc also free sir you gave gift sir itc also you have gifted sir you will not get it goods lost sir itc also lost sir goods stolen sir itc also stolen sir goods jaye bhad mein sir itc jaye bhad mein sir ha so this is as simple as that so later this is all about section number 17 subsection 5 and later they have given some of the explanation and how the itc has to be reversed so reversal of itc so this point it is itc reversal when re, uh, returns when the return of time barred or expired medicine drugs are treated as fresh supply so this for this i am making one new video please do wait for the video because many of the students they have asked this question to me somehow it got spick, skipped in the class not spicked skipped it skipped in the class so we will discuss about this in the next video so we will discuss about this in the separate video tax paid on the fraud cases section number 17 subsection 5 clause i says that tax paid in fraud cases detention uh, confiscation etc in that case section number 17 subsection 5 i clause i says that no so fraud cases may if you are a fraud itc also gone you are a fraud no i will also become fraud the government says this all these are blocked credits section number 18 we will discuss in the next part of the video until then people keep studying keep growing love you all miss you by hail gstic park